Hey, what's going on guys? It's No Shoes and we're back with another K Reno Friday and today we're going to be reacting to Welcome to Life featuring K Nice. This is suggested by Young Rugged and Raw, so thank you Young Rugged and Raw for the suggestion. Keep them coming in the comments down below. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you want to see more K every single Friday. But without any further ado, let's get right into this. Let's see what K Reno and K Nice have to say. Let's see what Welcome to Life is all about. Let's get it. Like it nice slow beginning feels like we're gonna get something emotional maybe a little sentimental we'll see where it goes from here but let's hear what k gotta say gotta take it for what it is man welcome to life the whole thing the joy and the strife where it's easy to do the wrong thing and hard to do right all the good and the bad forces the marriages the divorces the wealth and the poorness the big wins and the big losses we walk through Okay, so we start off, we're talking about some of the big contradictions in life. It's easy to do bad, hard to do right, talking marriages, divorces. We're getting a lot of contradictions. Let's see where it moves. Bad forces, the marriages, the divorces, the wealth and the poorness, the big wins and the big losses. We walk through life blindly, seeking anointment. Only your fool thinks he can make it through minus the disappointment. You had money. Make it through what? Anointment. Only a fool thinks he can make it through minus the disappointment. You had money and blew that. Only a fool mate thinks he can make it through minus the disappointment. Interesting bars here, but we're getting the mixture. It's a mixture of all things. Some good, some bad. Through life blindly, seeking anointment. Only your fool thinks he can make it through minus the disappointment. You had money and blew that. So now you're spending time trying to redo that. And risk losing yourself trying to pursue that. The fire used to burn in you. But what you interesting. Risk losing yourself trying to pursue that. That's definitely a fact, man. Sometimes you can lose yourself in the process, in the machine, in whatever it is that you're running after. To redo that and risk losing yourself trying to pursue that the fire used to burn in you but once you hit a few bumps your spirit broke instead of using them as learning tools some big plans you was crafting out and fashioning but soon as problems came you got discouraged and cashed them in you want some sympathy afraid to face that entity but without opposition that can never be a victory if you ain't know it then i bet you know it now struggle don't discriminate it's enough pain to go around Welcome to life. Okay, interesting. Let's bring this back a little bit here, a couple of those last bars. Face that entity, but without opposition, that can never be a victory. If you ain't know it, then I bet you Without opposition, there can never be a victory. That's facts, man. It's always like the joke, you know, when you're playing a video game, you know you're going the right way because you find the new enemies to fight against. You know it now, struggle don't discriminate. It's enough pain to go around. Welcome to life. Nice transition in and out of that hook section there. Very interesting tone we're getting from K on this track, especially with that hook. The singing comes through kind of fast. It's very powerful. And um, it doesn't feel like super consistent with the tone we have K hitting, but it's a nice change. I like the change in pace. Just enough for living. Welcome to life. What you say, Kay? I said, welcome to life. Oh. Where your best friend might try to make a move on your wife to successfully be shit. Yeah, facts, man. It's the ones closest to you that'll surprise you, but who else would? If you thought they was a piece of shit, you wouldn't be surprised. 
friend might try to make a move on your wife. To successfully build, you gon' need incredible skill. Your child might get sick and you can't afford the medical bill. Trouble throughout, it ain't nothing worse than losing a spouse. Or getting fired from your job soon as you're moving your house. Going through hell. Damn, man. This is, this is fire. Just talking about some of the harsh, cold realities of life. I think... This verse, it sounds like we're focusing more on the bad. Maybe we'll get one more hook, and then we'll have a verse coming in talking about the good. We'll see how the structure plays out as we go. But I want to touch on that thing with the medical bills, man, because it is the most insane thing to me, just how expensive medical care, especially in the United States, is. It is absolutely ridiculous it's, it's running a racket man it's disgusting how much some of these procedures and everything co cost when you you know you look online you're you're on youtube right now and there's people talking about you know it cost them like 500 dollars to get three stitches or something like that it's like really really that's what it doesn't make any damn sense to me Try to make a move on your wife to successfully build. You gon' need incredible skill. Your child might get sick and you can't afford the medical bill. Trouble throughout. It ain't nothing worse than losing a spouse or getting fired from your job soon as you're moving your house. Going through hell. Try hard but still feel that you fail. And then sometimes, no matter what you do, your children rebel. Gotta stay composed. Your soul. Facts, man. I mean, the failure, it's part of it. You know, it's part of the journey. You would never know what success tasted like if you never failed. But at the same time, when you're down there, when you're when you're scraping along the bottom, it can be hard to see the light coming through, see any opportunities or any type of change that might come your way. And then sometimes, no matter what you do, your children rebel. Gotta stay composed. Your soul's too priceless to sell. And bad choices take you from freedom to nights in a jail. Might not have had the best parents, had to fend for yourself. Your hand was out plenty of times, had to extend it for help. You win the war, it ain't no time for losing your guts. Even the winner of the fight gon' have some bruises and cuts. It's human nature to complain, and we gon' do that for certain. But at some point, it's time to get up on your feet and start working. Welcome to life. Interesting. I love the feel of this, man. It's great. This is a real, you know, one of those real tracks talking about real life problems, what's going on, what he's seen, what his friends have gone through that he's witnessed. And, um, you know, it's very relatable. It's very relatable, especially talking about, you know, even if you win in the fight, you're still going to come out with some cuts and bruises. You know, if you get wrapped up in it, if you engage in that activity, you're going to end up getting beat up, too. There's just no way around it. Losing your guts. Even the winner of the fight gonna have some bruises and cuts. It's human nature to complain, and we gonna do that for certain. But at some point, it's time to get up on your feet and start working. Welcome to life. When there's few to console you, hold you, and show you that it's just enough. I think if we could go back and slightly shift this song a little bit, I think the overlap of the first part of the hook with the end of the verse, I would pull those apart a little bit and just have maybe like a tiny little bit of space between them. I think it would help smooth out that transition and it would make like the change in tone a little bit more... Uh, it would just feel, again, it would feel smoother to that change of tone as well, not just the transition between K to K nice, but in all of it. To a life where there's few to console you, hold you and show you that it's just enough, just enough for living. Can't comprehend it, you've been down for a minute. Soon as you get some money, something pops up and you gotta spend it. Over time, we see the real... Ain't that a fact right there, man? I just had that this past weekend for real, you know. Finally, you know, school ended, went out, had a great time at the beach with some friends, you know, did a couple things, you know, spent a decent amount of money that I'm not normally spending and then immediately got to replace the car battery and all this, that, and the other. And it's like, oh, man, come on. As soon as I start having fun, I got to start making some real purchases. What is this? 
Can't comprehend it, you've been down for a minute. Soon as you get some money, something pops up and you gotta spend it. Over time, we see the real side of those we befriended. Lifelong connections broken up and instantly ended. Years flying by and the wounds still haven't mended. Agenda driven individuals who only pretended. Nothing wrong with forgiveness after you've been offended. Apologizing doesn't make you weak, call, say it or send it. It's not about the span of it. That's facts, man. Apologizing doesn't make you weak. In fact, I think it makes you stronger for the ability to be accountable and hold yourself accountable to your own actions and understand when you've done something wrong. Let's bring it back. A little. And the wounds still haven't mended. Agenda driven individuals who only pretended. Nothing wrong with forgiveness after you've been offended. Apologizing doesn't make you weak, call, say it, or send it. It's not about the span of existence, but more how you live it. Every single second. That's facts right there, too. Nobody knows how much time we got. And it's sad to see that some of us have a lot less time than others. So live it how you're going to live it. Stop worrying about these other people. Stop worrying about all the nonsense and the noise. You be happy. Since but more how you live it. Every single second given, just thank God for the privilege. And as you face every day, your mind reaches a place where you realize it's not about the worldly things that you chase. Don't let your bad actions wipe out all the good that you've done. How can one dark moment overshadow the sun? Now you seem in the doubt all that you were. Facts. How can one dark moment outshadow the sun? And I think that's a great thing to relate to the rest of life, too, because, you know, some people, they have a bad five minutes. It turns into a bad day, turns into a bad two days, turns into a bad week, turns into a bad month, you know, whatever, whatever. It continues on. Don't let that be you, man. Let it accept it and then, you know, let it go. You don't need to hold on to all that bad energy, all that nonsense. Whatever it is that might be holding you down, holding you back, it's probably over already. And worrying about it certainly ain't going to fix it. Now you seem in the doubt all that you was dreaming about. Don't sit around and pout as if the world singled you out. Welcome to life. And that's another one too. And that's what's such a beautiful thing about music is don't sit around and pout and think that the world singled you out. Music one songs like this help you understand and realize that you're not alone in these struggles that you're going through these problems that you're having and then it also just is a lot more freeing to 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 realize that it's not just all on you and that you're the one being beat up by the world and it's you that you know take away some of that blame it's not always that personal a lot of the times, people who do shitty things to you, they don't even mean to do it to you. They don't realize. So, just, again, take that breath. Let it go. It's not only happening to you. So you hold you and show you that it's just enough. Like it so the hook i know i had some you know ideas about how we could change it reshape it to make it fit a little better i think the big thing for me is that you ever eaten something and it just has that flavor that like really sticks out and it's just not in balance with the rest of the meal and that's kind of the feeling that i'm getting here where the, the hook fits, the energy is there, it's right, but I think we could pull back on it just a tiny bit. It comes through really strong, and it just almost feels like it. we're like going into a different song than transitioning into the hook. I feel like maybe if we pulled back a little bit on it, 
so it wasn't so strong. And then when we get to this section here at the end where some of the instrumental falls out and we get to focus more on the vocal, that's where we can rise up into that strength that we've had the whole time. And it'll make it that much more meaningful at the end. And um, I think that would just fit a lot better. Long story short, let's finish this out. I mean, that was a fantastic song. Very in-depth. Kay talking about life, the struggles, the strife, the good times, the bad, everything in between. It was beautiful. I hope you all enjoyed it. I certainly did. Thank you again to Young, Rugged, and Raw for the suggestion. Keep coming in the comments down below. Don't forget to hit like, hit subscribe, and hit that bell if you want to see more K every Friday. Much love to everybody in the No Shoes Gang, and I will see you all next time.